So it is now the following Wednesday. So like, well, not the following. It is now Wednesday, which is, I think, day seven. So we left last Wednesday, so which was a week ago. And I'm about to do something really fun. I'm so excited. I'm going to meet up with one of my favorite YouTubers, Anne-Marie Chase. And she actually lives in Alaska. She lives in Anchorage. And we're going to meet up for some coffee. And I'm so excited. Let's go do this on this very rainy Wednesday morning. <laughs> What is this, a concert or is it a... Yeah, concert. Oh, fun, when? So what are the dates to it? We're going up there. You guys could... It's not even crowded because it's... I think she's gonna... Almost back at the bottom! <laughs> Hi guys! Hey! Ciao! Ciao! Ciao -y. Ciao -y. Molly and I, one time we were coming down from this, oh my god, I have the video, and it was a flippin' snowstorm, and there was oh. a moose. No! And we videoed it, it was so fun. Coming in hot. having such a great day today. So first I went out for coffee with Anne Marie, which was so much fun and it was so good to chat with her. She is just so cool. If you guys don't already watch her videos, you definitely should. She's an amazing YouTuber. Her videos are stunning and so raw and authentic and amazing. And they're also filmed here in Alaska, most of them. So that's a huge perk too. After that, then I went and hung out at my aunt's house for a little bit. And then we, oh my gosh, I see Ryan. Then we went for a hike up Flat Top Mountain, which was so gorgeous and beautiful. We didn't go to the top. We almost went to the top, but it was super snowy and we just didn't really feel like need because the view is already beautiful. So we did that and then we went to a tea shop, which was really cute. We got my aunt some matcha supplies. I'm gonna get her hooked on matcha. And then we went looking for mooses or moose and we didn't find any, but I'm optimistic that we'll find some at some point. So now we're about to have a taco night, my cousins are over, and it's gonna be a super fun night. behind me it's beautiful like every other place in Alaska 
And this is like pretty much the closest we're probably gonna get to the Pacific Ocean because this is a little inlet called Resurrection Bay. Also, can you even hear me? Maybe I should do this from the car later. Okay, we'll resume this in the car because it's very windy. We're gonna stop and get Ryan a coffee and then we're gonna leave for real. This is all of downtown Seward right here. Nestled in the mountains. We ended up kind of So we ended up leaving Seward. We didn't do much there. We just kind of like walked around, went to a couple stores and whatnot, went out to lunch, which was so good. If you ever find yourself in Seward, please go to Gold Rush Bistro. It was amazing. But now we are at Exit Glacier, which is stunning. I, I've only seen one glacier before. One glacier. I've only seen one glacier before and it was in Iceland. So this is what it looks like. It's way in the distance. It's this little thing right there. So that glacier used to start back in 1815. It started where I'm standing and it's receded that much over the years, which is super sad. But even though it's sad, it's really pretty. Look at this. So pretty. Just like me. Just like you. Can you see it still? I can't get it on video. is Portage Glacier, which it took us a while to find because it's pretty melted and we think it extends over there as well because you can see a little bit of the blue ice up there. And there's also ice floating in the water, which is really cool. And the water is like a bright blue, if you can't tell. What? There's more ice. Oh yeah, more ice. So this is near where it's thought that the congressman Begich and Boggs' plane went down in the 70s and I listened to an amazing podcast about that. So I'm going to link that in the description because it kind of gives some cool but sad context to this beautiful area. <laughs> day nine i guess yeah and we leave tomorrow morning at 3 a.m alaska time which is 7 a.m home time so like even though it's early today it's like our last real day even though we're technically leaving tomorrow so i was doing a little bit of work this morning and it's just so nice to do work in like a very calming atmosphere like this and today we have a whole list of things that we want to do before we leave 
and we're just gonna check everything off the list today i did most of my repacking last night so that's great and can you hear that one of my favorite things about anchorage and maybe this is how it is in most of alaska but there's so many small planes because a lot of people own planes here to get around because the state is so big and you can always just hear planes flying overhead and it's such like a nice calming sound i guess i don't know i feel like it's just really cute that there's so many planes flying around one last time at our favorite coffee shop that we found the black dishwasher now because I don't know what I want and I want to buy a family. <laughs> you're like on the ground you're like <laughs> can't even speak. We think we are so funny with this. The question is how long is it going to take for someone to know this? Probably We're at hours. Trapper Jacks. So at home, we have this beautiful mural of a giant whale. And when we were driving around downtown Anchorage the other day, we noticed this. It's another whale mural. And I recognized the signature of the artist in the top corner, Wyland, because he spells it with only the Y in lowercase. And I realized, well, we looked it up and the same guy made a mural in our hometown as in Anchorage, Alaska. It's crazy. There it is. Oh, we got a singer. The Rustic Goat. <laughs> oh wait, that's a sheep. That's on video. <laughs> That's not even the noise goat makes. I don't know. Maybe it is. This place is cool. <laughs> Brian, you should know what a goat makes. Oh my god, there's like no parking. I see one. Oh, that's good. Did you get a quarter? Yeah. I already, I already picked my seat. Cheers. Over here to check in. Oh, I should get that. And then one. What? Cheers. Yeah. So this has been our beautiful home for the past week and a half. We've been staying in my aunt and uncle's camper. So this is where my brother has been sleeping. That's where my cousin slept. And then this is where we've been sleeping. Our very messy little back area. But honestly, it's been so comfy and so nice.
she's doing a gram. A gram? You take. I was going to. What's that? Oh, I don't think There's text. Nice work. Would you like to be tagged, Tim? All right, everybody. Oh, I'm not boomerang it. My friend, no. Cheers. Tim, do you want to be tagged? Oh, that's right. That's right.